Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. For those who are new to my channel, my name is Elaine. I'm the owner of what? LBE. All right, y'all. So y'all see my Amazon order came in. Um, I told you guys, I posted about the um, cellophane rolls that I got from Michael's. Um, those are just, because that's a 40 by 100 roll of cellophane. Um, those are just for like my larger baskets and for like, I'm stocking them for the year. So those are not only just for Easter. Um, those will be for baskets throughout the entire year. Um, I like to stock up at the beginning of the year um, so that I make sure I'm secure and don't have to go back to the store for a while, hopefully. Uh, so we'll see how Easter goes. I may run through a couple rolls for Easter, but um, for the most part, I should have enough to um, justify the rest of the way um, as far as Easter goes um, um, because I order bags as well. So for those of y'all who are new to my channel, you need to see the Valentine's Day um videos you know well you don't know but um i use cellophane bags as well for baskets um now a lot of people use the shrink wrap bags well honestly the shrink wrap bags are great but the cellophane bags are much inexpensive 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 <laughs> and you get a large quantity for a really nice price um so i got my ipad here to give me my notes um, but for anyways, for the bags here that I have, um, of course you guys know, I live by the 18 by 30 bags and when I can find them in a nice quantity, um, I'm going to get them regardless. Um, and y'all know I make a lot of hand bowls, but when you in crunch time sometimes and you have to hurry up and get 12 mean uh, baskets out and you just need a quick bowl, it's okay to use pool bowls. I've learned that over the years to so just give in and just have them on hand just in case, um, you have some last minute stuff going. Um, so anyway, and with all these holidays, like Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Father's Day, um, church, you know, gifts or anything for that nature, when you have all that going on, sometimes you have to deal, you gotta, you gotta use what you gotta use. Okay. Um, so anyway, um, uh, it's the best, the best way I can say to invest in that type of stuff is to find the bags, um, that come with the, uh, bowls as well. So, for instance, we have the 18 by 30 bags. Okay, these are um, $21.99 on Amazon, which is basically $22. Okay, when you order these, you order them in the case of 50. They don't come in cases of 100, but you get a case of 50. Um, when you get the 50, then you also get 50 free bows or 50 bows to go with it. So, um, that's like spending 22 cents per bag and 22 cents per bow. Um, when you think about that in terms of like going to get bags from the Dollar Tree or other places of that matter, um, you think about the cost efficientness of being able to utilize, um, spend your money wisely. Okay. And as a business owner and somebody that makes large quantity of baskets, I have to make sure that I spend this money wisely. <laughs> Um, and each year, every, at the beginning of every year, um, I always take the time to restock up on my, my stuff, uh, especially my supplies. Um, I like to save money on my supplies so that I can spend a little bit on the merchandise going in. Okay. Um, so for instance, these, of course, I'm gonna put the bows up. I'm not going to use the bows, um, for Easter, but I will use the bags for Easter. And by using these bags, um, it's going to make it so much easier for me to um, get the smaller baskets done in a, in a, you know, a decent amount of time. Um, so, again, this is a 50 count bag of 18 by 30 bags. Um, and this is the same company that made the 24 by 30 bags that I use for Valentine's Day. Um, and I decided to go with their 18 by 20, I mean, uh, 18 by 30 bags. Um, just because I, I really like the, the 24 by 30. So I was like, you know what, why not just get the 18 by 30s too. Um, and then I also went with their, um, another, uh, pack of the, uh, larger size as well. Um, uh, but we'll get into it in just a second. So again, let me recap on the 18 by 30s. Um, these are 50 count uh, for $21.99, basically $22.00. Um, and again, that when you buckle down that, as far as like separating against how many, how much you spend in per bag and per bowl, it's about 22 cents a piece, which is not bad at all. Okay. Now we get into the larger quantity of the bags. Um, I use, uh, for Valentine's day I did, or Christmas, I ordered the hundred count on these, either hundred or 50 count. I can't remember. These are the 24 by thirties. Well, they have a 200 count. 
Um, and I feel like with the 200 count, you're saving even more because the 200 count is $45.99, which is $46. But when you break that down per bag and per bowl, you're spending like 11 cents. Y'all see what I'm saying? Like it beats paying a dollar twenty-five or sixty cents or whatever you're paying at Dollar Tree. I don't know. I don't even know if they even sell cellophane bags anymore. But for those y'all who want to try to use cellophane or whatever, um, or try to practice with cellophane, I wouldn't suggest going to get a big quantity like this if you're not used to using cellophane. I would suggest that you try a ten count or whatever. Practice with that ten count. See if you like it, and if you like it, then invest in the larger quantities. Do not go order this stuff if you are not familiar with using cellophane bags. I would try to teach as well, as long as I continue to make the baskets on how I close them up. For those y'all who are not uh, who are new to my channel, I always seal the bottom down first, then I close up the top of the bag. Therefore, I can eliminate a lot of airspace and things like that when I close them up. But we'll go into detail about that later. Um, but again, this is my investments for the year. This will get me through any order, daily order, fruit baskets, whatever I need to wrap up, baby. Let me tell you something. I'm going to utilize these bags to the fullest. And I am low on bags, so it's time to re-up and get my inventory, uh, I mean, my uh, supplies back on hand. Um, so I do spend a little bit, you know, on supplies. But at the end of the day, I'm saving so much money, okay? Um, just like the cellophane rolls I showed you guys. Um, from Michael's on my community post. Um, those cellophane rolls were $13.99. Then I had the 25% off coupon. Then because I shop at Michael's so much in regards to cellophane and stuff like that. Um, and some of my supplies I get from Michael's, not a lot, but because of the, the shopping that I do and the, or I guess the amount that I spend, I get like the little extra vouchers and things like that. So, I had a $10 off voucher and then I think additional $5 off. Like I was saving so much money with my points and stuff that I earned that I hardly spent any money on the cellophane and stuff like that. So that's another way you can save. If you shop at, uh, at Michael's, you need to get the app. You need to sign up and get the little account with the rewards account. So baby, you can start every time you purchase something, you can start earning points and rewards. So when it's time to restock up on your supplies, like your cellophane roll, um tape boxes whatever you want to get from there or even if you want to get some stuff to like organize your um your um office and things like that you'll be able to use those points to go towards it to help you save some money i'm just trying to figure out a way to help y'all save some money on on your end so you don't be spending 12 million dollars on you know different stuff and feel like you're going broke or you're spending all your money on your supplies um, this would allow you to be able to spend more money on the merchandise going in. Okay, so this time when I ordered these, um, these are the 32 by 40, which are these larger bags. Uh, bags. Um, these are, um, they come in a 50 count only. Um, and this time I decided to go with the gold bowls because you never know. And I was like, well, I already got pink coming in with the 200 count. And I already got red coming in with the with the 50 count 18 by 30 so let me go with gold that way i have a variety of different color bows um so anyway this is the 50 count of um 32 by 40 bags these were 24.99 for 50 so that's like 50 cents a piece without the bows but if you add in the bows and take away that it's like 25 cents a bag 25 cents a bow at again this is not <laughs> You're not breaking the bank. You're just buying this stuff ahead of time. So therefore, when it's time to make or do whatever you need to do, you don't have to run out and buy supplies over and over again. I have learned this over the years. I got tired of going to Dollar Tree after Dollar Tree after Dollar Tree trying to find bags and stuff. And I couldn't find the bag. Then the cellophane roll was too small or it wasn't enough left on the cellophane roll to cover the bags. Like it was just, it's just, it's a headache. So, um, I like to stock up on supplies um, to make sure I'm secure for the remainder of the year. I know a lot of you all are shrink wrap fans. I can't really give you a whole lot of details on the price of shrink wrap bags. I've only ordered, um, the 24 by 30 bags, um, and then 20 by 20 bags. Um, and I use them <laughs> very rarely do I use them. Okay. Um, so it's just easier for me, especially when it's vending time, uh, when I have to hit the streets with these baskets, it's easy for me to just use regular cellophane, baby. Because if, like I said, like I showed you guys on a previous video with the con con uh, la, 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 la. <laughs> with the condensation, uh, 
inside of the bags. It's just easy to pop that bad boy open, let it air out, close it back up, and sell that basket, okay? Um, so anyway that's what i want to come on here and talk to you guys about um in regards to the cellophane bags um and what i use and the different varieties again if you do not use cellophane bags and you are not used to using regular cellophane because you are a shrink wrap bag or shrink wrap person fanatic do not go and purchase all of these bags and have them sitting there because you ain't tried to practice or you don't know what you're doing or something like that. I do not want you to spend your hard-earned money on these bags unless you use cellophane bags. These for all the people that use regular cellophane and that knows how to use regular cellophane. If you do not know how to use regular cellophane, please go to your local Dollar Tree or Dollar General um, or anywhere that sells them. Grab you a couple bags, Michaels or whatever, Hobby Lobby. Grab you a couple bags, practice with them first. If you like it, if you get, if you can get familiar with it, roll with it and make your baskets and then you can go on amazon and place your order but please do not order this stuff and be like it'll be had me order it and they just sitting here and i done wasting my money no because i'm gonna tell you right now don't come for me because i come for your back okay <laughs> i love y'all but i'm being real now don't go spending this money if you're not gonna use these bags and y'all know for sure i use mine faithfully so i just want to point that out just want to show you guys um <laughs> these bags <laughs> y'all i'm so serious some of y'all be like you i spent this money and i ain't even used them and and uh i remember you saying something about it and listen it's 2024 stop wasting your money okay if you're not gonna use the bags don't buy them um i'm just pointing out things that i have gradually um learn to uh invest in that makes it beneficial for my company and my business it makes it easier on me to be able to um, put my stuff in a bag, tape it down nice and neat, send it out the door, okay? Um, if you're not one of those people that can work your way with regular cellophane, please don't go get it. That's the same way as those cellophane rolls at Michael's. If you're not used to using regular cellophane, please don't go get it. Please go to Dollar Tree, get you one roll from the Dollar Tree and practice with that one roll until you get familiar with it. And, it's, and all your frustration is gone. Then you go spend your money on the bigger stuff because the bigger stuff is what's going to save you in the long run. Um, as you can see, I'm spending way less than 50 cents on every bit of these items, which makes it beneficial for me when it comes time to making these baskets. I'm making a decent profit because I have not went and spent a million dollars. Okay. This is what I'm trying to preach and teach. <laughs> <laughs> so that you can continue to run a successful business and not be to feel like you going out of your pocket. You know what I'm saying? When, when it comes to, um, your supplies and even your merchandise as y'all, I don't know if y'all saw my last short about the little, the little bubble disc, find larger items at, at a reasonable price for a dollar 25. You couldn't beat that. It makes a difference when you're trying to fill baskets. It helps you save your money and also be able to make a decent profit and a decent living, decent, decent earnings off of these gifts. Um, so that's what I wanted to point out. Um, just wanted to, you know, bring this to you guys' attention. Um, I will share links with those who ask. I'm not just going to post the links because I feel like some of you all are going to order just because I'm showing y'all this stuff in the video. And I really want y'all to think smart in 2024, spend your money wisely um so that it will be beneficial for you in the long run okay thank y'all so much for watching don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and we'll see y'all next video peace